Welcome back. Yesterday, we introduced you to Noah Samara, chairman and CEO of Yasmi USA Incorporated, who some consider the founding father of satellite radio. In part two of the conversation with him, Mr. Samara talks to viewers Yehayez Wuhib about his company's latest venture, the Yasmi system, which would offer the world's first satellite-enabled com tablet computer to young people around the world. The ASME system consists of a satellite network, a tablet, a server in, in, that sits in a school and creates a Wi-Fi connectivity and provides continuous satellite updates to the tablets and the devices that students are using and a solar power charger for places where electricity is non-existent and, uh, and content. The Yasmi system is operational right now in Addis Ababa, Ethiopia, and of all places, at a high school, St. Joseph. How did that all come about, and is Yasmi having the intended effect? In May of, the, uh, of this year, we, uh, we uh, went to the principal of St. Joseph, which was the high school I went to. I think that school is familiar to me too, okay. <laughs> yes, indeed. <laughs> yes, indeed. So, um, so uh, we went to him and we suggested a pilot, um, but we wanted to do the pilot in a very highly uh, um, measured kind of way. We wanted to measure outcome. We wanted to see whether there was a difference between students who, uh, who used this tablet and students who didn't. So we crafted the, the design of the, the pilot itself in a very careful way. We took the syllabus that St. Joseph follows, which is the Ethiopian syllabus. We took that sort of textbook, two-dimensional content went to content makers and we said following this this syllabus lesson by lesson we want you to give us the best content that explains that concept from uh, from uh, the, the best content that that can be found mm -hmm. so they would went on and they took each lesson amplified each lesson and reduced it into a video or content that summarized that lesson in you know several minutes so the way the pro the program would begin is at each lesson the teacher would get content that is specialized that teaches the teacher how to best and most effectively teach that particular lesson to the classroom then the, the, the teacher teaches based upon the, the learning experience, uh, teaches for the first 30 minutes or so or, or 35 minutes of the, of the class. Then the video is played as a reinforcer to what the students have just learned. Uh, and, and then after that, there is an assessment that occurs so that they, they self-test and that assessment automatically goes to a server.